So about a year ago, I met with Drew McMullen at Sultana, and we were talking about, you know, the Arts Council's been funding Downrigging Weekend um, for music performances um, for many years now. And, and Drew said, you know, if you're interested, we'd love to see you produce something. Rather than just write us a check, would you really jump in and produce something relevant to Downrigging Weekend? And I said, yeah, I'd love to do something like that. And I think it maybe was two weeks later that I was at the library and I heard Robert Earl Price reading some poetry at the library. And Robert Earl wrote a piece called The Unlading that he wrote after experiencing Downrigging Weekend. We know for a fact that at least two of the ships that are in our harbor for Downrigging Weekend are models of ships that were built specifically for the swift importation of slaves through the Middle Passage. The Dutch Man of War, which is the Kalmar Nickel, um, and then the ship that is the style of the Pride of Baltimore II. Robert wrote this spectacular piece called The Unlading, which is based on a historical document that was a diary entry or letter entry of John Rolfe, who was um, very important in Jamestown. John Rolfe was actually married to Pocahontas, um, living in Jamestown, and the August 1619 of the arrival of a Dutch man of war that was trading slaves, not purposefully to Jamestown, but when they arrived, they needed provisions. And the only way they could provide, they could buy those provisions was to unload what John Rolfe wrote, his exact words were 20 and odd negars, N-E-G-A-R-S. That's the text in the document. It's the only reference in a three-page letter that he was writing home to London to these people. And they were, in fact, the first enslaved Africans to step foot on North American soil. Later, in the census, those 23 people were simply referred to as unfree. So Robert Earl has written a poem that gives voice to those 23 characters. I heard that poem, I asked him could he expand it into a dramatic piece, and he set to work. So we commissioned him to write this short dramatic piece, it's about a 30 minute piece, um, that uses six actors um, to play three or four characters each. And they each get a stanza, essentially, that allows them to tell the world envision to the world who these 23 people were. Um, we, we went down the street and talked to the folks at Jane's Church. We sat down with them and they were just like, oh, oh yes, please do this here. And so we're gonna do per four performances of the show over the course of Downrigging Weekend, which just happens to be the weekend right before the Migration Project Week. <laughs> it's gonna be a busy fall.